This is day 256 of the Arach Shulchan Yoimi. Today is Arach Shulchan Yoimi, a sponsor with Fur Shlema for Chana Fagel Bas Yenta. Chana Fagel Bas Yenta by her son. May she have a Fur Shlema uh, Bekarov Mamish. Uh, if you would like to sponsor an upcoming Shear or more of the Arach Shulchan Yoimi, please contact me directly. It'd be very much appreciated. Today we're doing Siman Kuf Ayin Zayin Sivches. So last night we said the Ches is a long sif, and that's why we didn't do it last night. You know, it's the last sif in the Simon. But so Rosh Hashanah says Ches. For God, mysterious who shined to me, honey. I'm astonished by the mysterious contradiction who shined me. Imkidi very Rashba, where the Rashba, which you saw in the previous sif, to be correct, so so that uh, uh, you have to make a bracha chreina. That but on the part Paris before the before the muzzle, have the Yushami the Mar Pligadoni. So then the Yushami should say that it, the two uh, different uh, statements it brings down, which in one of which indicates that there you do not have to make a brachana, and the other which indicates you do have to make a brachana, contradict one another. So Orchus says in his opinion there is no machlokes. After Rabbi Ba will come and Mishnah Bar Paris. That, that which Rabbi Ba said, which seems to indicate that you have to make a brachana be on the parperes before the the food. It's on the mission of the parperes. B'zeh shon yushami on birachah parperes chila. If you made a bracha on the parperes first, come a modi lo patas a pas. Everybody agrees you didn't exempt the bread from my sectera nor whatever is made in a pot. Rabbi Abba boy, Rabbi Abba asked, I hate the achol solis. Some of you ate flour. V'dayte mechal pita and has a mind to eat bread. V'chulei v'kasha. This is the exact halacha par Paris. And it says it doesn't exempt the bread. But uh, uh, it's explicit, it doesn't require a bracha chreina, like we saw previously. So it seems that this is the case. Um, uh, the, um, if somebody is eating hors d'oeuvres before the meal, he doesn't need bracha chrona. But then we should say bracha by Paris leaf now Muslim. That's the Mishnah, which says that you made a bracha by Paris before the food, before the meal, you don't want to make a bracha chrona. I've Rabbi Abba boy, Rabbi Abba specifically asking, Misha Ako Solis below Kamana Lachlan if Neha Suda, he Mishim Par Paris, he ate uh, uh, some sort of Mazonas, but without having in mind he's going to eat a Suda afterwards, and that this is the four spice, the uh, the, uh, the hors d'oeuvres for the, that meal. Um, uh, 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 there's no connection to the meal. There's no contradiction whatsoever. Vote in front of the previously on Mishnah Doi of Honor, meaning Harbe, when somebody has many types in front of him, please show me the Shomalei of Rabbi Abba. Shomalei of Rabbi Abba, Machloi, because be my own be daito le, be daito le, ho pas. If you had a mighty bread, in Tzor, the bar, bracha, chrona, ala, peros, if it is a bracha, chrona, on fruit. The Rabbi Yushua, ben Lebi, Svir, le, the answer it. Rabbi Shomalei beholds, yeah, you don't need a bracha, chrona, on fruit. Uh, Rabbi Abba says, you do. And they love me, but I'm like Rabbi Yishuab and Levi. Because that's saying to behold, like Rabbi Yishuab and Levi, you say, I don't say with Birkas HaMozun. El, uh, if you Rabbi Abba knows, that he's a dafka b'stam peros. According to our question, what's to be mechadish? Even Rabbi Abba seems to say, who says, you need a bracha after the, for the fruit, separate from Birkas HaMozun. That's specifically by stam peros, generic fruit. Shein boi le garolam shecha label tayba samacho. So you're not coming to, uh, uh, induce your, uh, appetite. In other words, fruit is snack, right? So the chiddush that uh, cantaloupe is considered to be like an appetizer, right? So I think Rosh Hashanah mentioned something about that somewhere, but I don't recall what he exactly says. Um, uh, the, uh, so uh, that case, they don't come to br uh, uh, bring the heart to desire food, and uh, uh, so the position of the Zman. Uh, uh, that's the case where you need a bracha achreina on those fruits. But if they come, indeed, even before the meal, for the purpose of drawing the appetite, 
אין צורך ברכה אחרונה, they don't need ברכה אחרונה, וכן גם כמה סום רשבה אני לא מכן. And it says, I'm sure, I'm pretty sure, that's the intent of the רשבה, אף על פי שום ראשון לא ממש מגן. If it doesn't seem to be saying that, מכל מקום נאמר, מוטב לדחות בכוונה סו, it's best to be דויכק, something, you know, to use a steam shovel, to get this into the רשבה, מלומר דבר שהוא כנראה גם משנה, to say something that the רשבה saying, going gets him, ממש לא מפורשת. That uh, the Brachas and Masa works with the Parperes. Upshita. It's uh, it's uh, 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 obvious. The Shabbos can listen after Kiddush and Shabbos and they put after Kiddush. My name is Sika. The Shari Dvarim, sweets and other things on the table. The item Shabbos Michael so he told you them Chobas and they have my very shortly um, wash their hands and eat bread. I answer about Chorin. They definitely don't need Bracha Chorin on those Parperos. So the Kiddush Mokum Suda because Kiddush is Mokum. Malcolm Suda, and therefore, the Kiddush unites everything. Vakol uh, humi asuda, everything now becomes part of the meal. The practice says here, Vav shem agav ram simen reish mem tes, sikhon above lo mash makeng. Hi, magav ram doesn't seem to say that. Yesh lomai lo shlo achal tech lasuda. Magav ram perhaps tongue based within and merely eat the meal. Chayadam klam memav simen dal nidchak bezeh ayin shlam bein tzorch. Chayadam has a doichak, but... It's not a problem according to what he wrote. Because the Chayyot the Pesach should make a bracha achrayna be Shabbos. Also, Chayyot them said on Shabbos he should make a bracha achrayna because there's a continuity. Kiddush mezoynas hamoitzi. Achtam aloni reli, but he doesn't says doesn't say this reason Chayyot seems and seems not to be one which the Orach Shulchan agrees with. He was writing in Hakel Ladina Eicher Ladina Kamosh Kosav Agdas Kamosh Kosavnu Kedas Agraz Varash Bazal according to Wayne Kamosh Kosavnu. In other words, that Bar Peres. Does, uh, and pa, uh, the, the parparis is including because of Moses. The Bir Alacha writes that uh, a mezonos before the meal you have to make a bracha achrona. If you have in mind to eat uh, mezonos also during the meal, then you don't make a bracha achrona. If you had other mezonos within the meal, not the same type. Some say that you can lie lechatchil on because of Moses and have in mind to exe to exempt them with the first mezonos, and some say. Uh, when you eat them only for pleasure, in other words, not as part of the meal, you have to make a bracha chorina before the meal, in other words, um, on the, those pastries which are not going to be eaten again during the meal. Um, and in terms of what we eat in Shabbos, Shachris, after Kiddush, Lekach, and Kichlin, uh, that uh, we only are, we're unsure if they have a dinner bas Baba Kisnin, because they only fit one of the definitions, it's best that uh, uh, even if you do not have any within the Suda, that according to anybody, you should not bake a bracha on them, but rely on Birkas HaMazon, and it's best to have in mind explicitly during Birkas HaMazon to exempt them. Okay, Sima Kufayin Zayin. Dine Edvarim Abayim Tocha Suda, Achra Suda, Seyri Birkas HaMif Neim Achrayim. Things which come within the meal and after the meal, the brachas to make before them and after them. Alva Paspoi Tocha Mneim Acholim Abayim Tocha Suda. Bread exempts all types of food which come within the meal. These are things which uh, it's the normal derech to uh, be kovei suda on them. The laugh is when it's a pass in order to um, in order to accompany the bread. Come a basa bedagim, but miracles: meat, fish, eggs, vegetables. Mr. Bura says that grain uh, and uh, squash and pickles. Um, which are raw, or uh, onions, or garlic, uh, garlic or onion, uh, no, not garlic, uh, or turnips, or, or onions, you have to make a brach on them separately if you eat them by themselves in the meal. Today, we, if we do eat these things, they're all we eat them as part of the meal, so this will not apply as much as that. Going on to our other things, chema, gvina, chol, butter, cheese, uh, milk, and porridge, chomenei tavshin, and all sorts of cooked dishes, saying Meshem Achil Vesviya, which are being eaten in order to to eat and be satisfied. Hey, chomenei muluchim, all sorts of salty things. Vafil ochlam below pasi, eating them without the bread. Ain't to the bracha of name. The other side mostly puts rosh and don't eat a bruch. Don't require bracha afterwards because I'm mostly exempt. But lach ram, and not afterwards the bracha some muslim both rosh and and because the benching exempts them. The osam shodam ochlam a pasi that's mo. Those are the, the the person eats with the bread, literally. We don't need the the svara the 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 reason that birchas hamotzi exempts them. Anyway, they're part because they are tofel. They're subordinate to the ikar, which is the bread. 
At the time the Birchus Amoti, the reason why we need to say Birchus Amoti exempts these is specifically for um, uh, uh, low pass for those accompaniments which are eaten separate from the bread. The name says Shishnei Pturim Yesh. So that, that comes out there are two exemptions. Echad Masha Pepe Pass Poiter. One is what the bread exempts. Vayno Macholim Shochim Pass Imahem. The food with which you eat bread. Vayab Turim Mishum Ikar Betafel. And the exemption is because of Ikar and Tafel. Vasheni. In other words, primary and subordinate. Vasheni. The second is Masha Bira Samosi Poteres. That which Bira Samosi exempts. The Bracha Mamosi exempts. Anyway, which comes for eating and satisfaction, berov tavshilin shalanu, because most of our cooked dishes shem ikar suda, which is the which are primary components of the meal. Beis lufiza mashuas rashi isi misha mistapek dim any chavzol lechol arbei pas besuda zu. The according to this says on Shul that which I saw that someone who seems to be a mug Avram is unsure if he doesn't have in mind to eat a lot of bread in this meal. Va'ochem at pas. He's only eating a little bread, bread, a little bit of bread. In between machol and being bracha is the food exempt from bracha. Fish ain't so much whole pasay because doesn't want to eat very much bread. Ain't but there's some shofik. There is no question. It's, it's certainly exempted. The bishla may up to your machmas a pas bilvad. If the exemption is only because of the bread, shabbos abkin and bezel would be a decent shofik. Ava putor mitam brichas am moitzi, but the exemption is not because of the bread, but because of the moitzi gamke. Also, a motzi. You came and she brought a motzi. Nifto ko amacholim haboy machmas asuda. And since we're going to make a motzi, all the, the food which comes on account of the suda is included. I feel ocha paswa kezayis. You mean only kezayis of bread? The bochus mikezayis and the ocha bar brichas amazon. Because the best of kezayis can be a brichas amazon. For a gamla amacholim no tzuchel brichas amazon. And also for these other foods, you need a brichas amazon. Lepoch bracha rod the exempt from a bracha chronic much kasabu. For kamash yimush macholim pasmot and our rich people only eat a little bit of bread because they're plenty of other food. Separate from the rest of the world. Brackets, he says, the soft without understanding. Whatever he means, Mr. Bura writes that the Khraim are not sure, like the Mogavo. There he said it's best to make a, 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 the proper bracha for each one and not eat bread at all. Which is kind of like the American custom today. Uh, uh, unless it's Shabbos yont or Yontem, then, then it's a mitzvah to eat a of bread, so that becomes, elevates it. The mitzvah to eat a of bread makes it more chashev, and therefore, even though it's size, everything else becomes tafel to it. Okay, Gimel. Vim ochem tocha suda dvarim haboyim shalom machmas suda. If each one of the meal things do not, are not intrinsically part of the meal. Ta'anu sh'en the derech lavis by mesapas. They're not normally eating to accompany the bread. Eating derech l'gvalim suda. You don't normally uh, uh, f- uh, make, make them a formal part of the meal. Shame boy, shame sweet, because they don't come for satisfaction. Contain them, such as figs, mandavia, grapes, chomene, pears, all sorts of fruits. Chomene, chen, mine, lachmanios, and also uh, sweet rolls. Shame boy, shame sweet, don't come to satisfy you. Come over, kikim, dakim, like uh, flat uh, uh, biscuits, the lekach, the tort, and lekach and tort, honey cake and torts. The does not work for to exempt them. The lamikers of the Sudan they're not the primary part of the intrinsically part of the primary components of primary part of the meal. They don't require bracha afterwards. Regardless, everything in the meal, because the Muslim put trust in, because the Muslim exempts them. Because the Muslim ugly, because the Muslim, the power of the Muslim is greater than that of Hamotzi. Then you say, for this, in terms of this, in Eshu Minatur, because the Muslim is the rights, which is not raised in the Kuf Ain Dalit. Because the Muslim is the rights, so therefore it has more uh, power. But if you eat the uh, bread with the fruit, answer the bracha. You don't require a bracha, mitam, ikar, betafa. Because the, the the fruit, even though it's weird, perhaps, but you wait in a way that the fruit is is tafel to the bread, so it's subordinate to the bread. That peros and tefillah pass. If you eat these uh, these biscuits or this lekach uh, and tort, ima pass kankeng. That also they are tafel. That pass ikar nei akol bread is the primary uh, 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 in relation to anything else. But people don't usually eat sweet rolls with bread. Nevertheless, 
nevertheless, uh, the uh, food does not require bracha. The end is a little shaykh. I'm sorry, no, okay, I read them wrong. Come on, Ochem. So he eats them with bread, even though he is weird, right? Answer the bracha. He still doesn't require bracha. The end is a little shaykh. I'm a little shaykh. Because in terms of this, you can't really go after most people. They call Echad Ochad Kishu Shabenav. Al Tam Barech in Litvakeach. You can't argue with people. They like eating that way. They like eating that way. So that uh, the 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 lekach and tort we come to filter the bread. Uh can you write the back is Kenya and I used the idea. Um <clears throat> the uh doubt. I have a uh double agros with somebody eats something after the meal. Well my meaning Zel Shabar Karl is that very hard boy my agros with the kind of smart Mara calls that things come after the meal before benching. Dessert. At the time of the Shas, the custom was at the end of the meal, the day is the passive, the stop eating bread. The same of some remove the bread. And then they would uh, designate themselves to eat fruit and to drink. Then, therefore, everything they bring then, it's whether the things which come out as intrinsically part of the meal, but the bread has been removed. Kedagi mubaso like fish and meat. Ben varboim shelo mach masasula things and also of course things which do not come in account in the meal. To the bracha ben name ben the lachre and the acquire bracha both before and after. That feel because the most eno poteres el mashim bar besochasula because even benching does not exempt things unless they are within the meal. Lo mashagos are not things which are after the meal, which in those after before benching is still considered after the meal. Uh, Without paski sonny do kapas except uh, uh, cake, which is similar to bread, uh, that uh, is exempted by uh, as to be a continuation of the meal. So as if you weren't Moshe Yotcha in a pas. And the Be'alocha has a great arichas about this, and he says that uh, in in porridge it's a machlekes as savik brachas lahakel. It's best to have in mind specifically to exempt brachas amazon, but that's not um, that's not uh, that's not. Or is talking about. Anyway, again, as he said, that uh, things which come at the end, uh, 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 should, uh, 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 does not exempt them. Right? The uh, um, the, it's as if you're eating out beyond the meal. She does Rashi into the rock with the arm should darken the bubble after Suda. Rashi does only talk about things which normally come after the meal. I would run should darken the bubble to a Suda, but things which normally come within the meal. I feel Ochel Akasu eating them after the meal, and ain't so broken and require broken. Chaim Ashukhar Mulash and Rambam, so Perik Dal seems to be what the Rambam seems to be saying. Because the Bore Boy Machra Suda, Tinch Kamath, you obey Machmasa Suda, whether it's an account of the meal, Beshlo Machmasa Suda, whether it's not an account of the meal, to him, Broka, Ben of Name, Ben Akhra, they require their own Broka independently, both before and after Kalashon. El Shalafiza, and a move of Machkasa, Be Machmasa Suda. But it's difficult with Rambam writes on account of the meal because then it is part of the meal. The uh, Cheni Re, the Yosef feel like she is touched by Rosh Kol So it seems that he holds like all the other uh, Rishonim as well. And uh, so it's Machmas the Suda doesn't require a bracha. Zesh Kasa Ben Machmas Suda Klomar Ben Bar Ma Boim Machmas Hasuuda thing that which are well even comes Machmas the Suda you still need a separate bracha. Uh, ben, uh, uh, it means even things which normally come within the meal, which can come within the meal, I should say, but if they come to the end of the meal, then they could come to dessert, they make their own brachas. But it means, if you started these same food stuffs in the meal, ain't so barach achreya. Hey, the customer I've been in the research of so busy based on our DNZ, but that was shut up. But DNZ achreya, no more to be nenu. This halacha, the chef makes separate brachas, and the dessert is not. Prevalent among us, Pisha ain't on a Moshim a day in a pass a rocker because I'm Muslim. We don't remove our hands from the bread until after benching. It ain't over till it's over. I can't cause what taste is by rush. Where are we shining? And it's the same time we create a suda by us. It's always cold in the meal. Yes, you cause some of the same. The suda's good. I was got out of me in a can to his man by banquets. The halacha is the same today as at the time of the shas. Yes, home is saying that others argue this. Because when they wrote, Shemizman Hashas, they were given a chorus of chorus. At the time of the shas, they used to uproot the tables. Shem Shuchon in time, that's small tables. But to Hashas, Shuchon God, now that we have big tables, famous Hakim, so then we don't remove the tables. Hakal, Mikhetok, Asuda. Everything is called within the meal. Sabi Brachos, Hakim. And Sabi Brachos, we are lenient. 
וכיוון שהטוב זה לא זכרים מהשירים גדולים, ואוכלבירס Don't see that we did. I don't see where they are. So maybe they did. Well, I don't see them. Okay. Um, the. Uh, it says brackets. I'm going to go to the other video. Sefta. Mareveran brings the Tosef that states as follows. Maliach she'abob itchil of ne'amazon, a salty food, which comes before the meal. Pasa boy ma maliach achamazon, and a bread which comes with salt, the salty food after uh, the meal. I'll be before back to the tuna. Brach requires a separate brach. I don't understand why I brought this. Hello, diva yachid heim. There's an individual, individual opinion in the Tosef. Tanakama cholikaz et tanakama argues this. Vachi tanya ahasam. This is what it says there. Maliach uprusa. If a person has a salty uh, food with bread, you make the, food, uh, the bracha and the salty food, but as a person, you exempt the bread. Rabbi Chaim Gamliel says, if it's a, b- b- uh, if it's a, a full salty food before the meal, etc. But that's only Rabbi Chaim Gamliel. Besides, this has to do with ikar and tava, what's primary and what's subordinate. There's no relevance of what bread exempts. Shall simulation base, become a shamo kama rechani a girl. Has to simulation base, the pipe ikabatava, and even there we don't pass the rechani a gun, come leo, elekatana kama, the duke.